Relax, relax. I did it. Look, I did it. Yo. All right. Look at that. What's up? I didn't know what was going on. Not much, not much. Yeah, no, I saw your Discord you try to thing. You gotta take your AK, bro, while you sleeping. Hey, yo, man, sussy. No, 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 I just didn't know what's going on. Yeah, no, I saw, nah, I saw your Discord it, thing as him. well as the, he was about the to stream. That was interesting. You know, obviously, their stream and the Discord message, they both said um, they're giving away free stuff at G12. Which is, uh, you know, I was like, oh shit, say less. Um, you know, easy, easy loot. And when I was looking at the stream, it seemed like they were stacked and stuff, you know, they could spare some stuff. But I guess actually running the shop here, kind of thing. So, yeah. What is this gun I got in it? Flashlight? Alright. Well, I have AK with no bullets. So I'm gonna be easy target. I guess the best thing I can do now is just grind up a spear, maybe. Wait. For the right moment to strike. Take a look at these, some of these hazmats. I got a lot on me at the moment, so all these are pretty good. 
If you remember, this was where I was when I first spawned in at the beach and where I met those guys. This was actually a vending shop that they were running on this stream and also sent to the Discord chat if I didn't make myself clear early in the video. I was just looking around browsing a bit, that's all. First off, hazmat. Secondly, let's go with, uh, SAR. Nice. Now we got a SAR. Don't want to get caught locking. Maybe also try to pick up those guns I had on me. Day two. Not only did we start off great, we also got a good raid going. Breaking down one to go off for all this loot. Who could go for anything better, especially a solo player like me. This wasn't the last of the loot I gained that day. I want to get those garage doors. Ah, yes, airfield. Place everyone likes to go. Not only that, place everyone needs to be. That's how you progress in the game. 
That's how you get loot. And one of the things most common is Chinook Creek. Let's go, bro. You're a bitch, bro. You're a bitch. You're a bitch. Bro, I blew... Not blue screen. I uh, combat wield, bro. I combat wield. Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. Combat wheeling, man. The dumbest thing to ever live. And he was fucking, he was camping outside the door too, bro. I saw him, bro, and I combat wheeled, bro. I combat wheeled. I would have got him if I just hit him one more time with the shoddy. Bro, are you kidding me, bro? You are garbage, man. Oh my goodness, bro. <laughs> Alright. Oh, snap, I already took him down. fighting gotta get in that Okay. Whew. Yeah, how simple, bro. Alright. This is gonna get where it's a bit confusing. We skipped a couple of days ahead into a new server. This time, it wasn't just me. I was talking with some guys in Discord. They wanted to team up. Some random group of four man, maybe a five man. And we all got together. And started a group. 
on the NA server. Okay. But, uh, and you don't have to give me anything or anything like that, but the deal is we'll kind of be allies, okay? This guy wanted to be allies with me and my team, and we both had pretty big bases in the area, and we knew that we had to get rid of each other before we could start building anymore. But we decided to team up for a bit, and I was actually talking to my teammate, and we did want to raid them, so we pretended to team up with them for now. But in addition, they were going to give us a high stone wall if we aligned with them for now. Walls around your base, and if y'all want, y'all can, uh, y'all can, like, farm stuff for us and in exchange. I'll give you scrap, because I'm really good at farming scrap. So you farm stuff, I'll give you scrap so you can research stuff. And if y'all give me the materials to make things y'all need to research, I'll make them. After talking with my team for a bit, we finally came to a conclusion on what we were going to do. Okay. Okay. You still there? Yeah, I'm still here. Okay, so I asked one of the guys and he... Hang on. He's, okay, I asked them and they were like, what? I asked them and they said, yeah, that's fine. And they wanted to know if you guys wanted to just do like a super clan thing, just like make a huge compound around both their bases, you know, just go on one big team together. You know, we don't need each other's codes or anything, just, you know, just one big compound stuff. Yeah, I'd have to, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Uh, I yeah, gotta, so I gotta talk to my team about it. None of them are on. It's only me on right now, so I'd have to talk to them about that. But like, I would, I honestly wouldn't be opposed to that. If we did that, uh, we wouldn't even really need to give you all the walls. We could just build the walls around, and y'all just do a lot of farming for the stone that we need. Yeah. To build the walls, you know. Yeah. But I mean, that that's not a bad idea. Like, like I wouldn't really call that a, a super team. Like. We'd be our own clans, you know, but we could be allies, and, you know what I mean? Yeah, what I our own bases, our own loot. Whatever. Yeah, what I was thinking is, you know, and we just, um... We do stuff for each other. Right now, I think we're, like, we're mostly, we're just a four-man team, and you guys are also a four-man team, so that can be, like, an eight-man team right there, you know. Hey, are you good? We can do that. But, I mean, the compound idea isn't actually that idea. I would like to do that. Yeah, yeah. Y'all want to do that. They, uh, also, yeah. yeah. At the farm and stuff like, y'all, y'all don't have any blueprints, do you? Um, I can check what blueprints um, we have so far. I, I think we just have like a pickaxe and axe. Nah, they. Okay, some people yeah. got guns. Okay, some people so have the axes. Like it's all mixed up, really. Yeah. Okay. Except for this side of work. Shotgun. We could build, we could build a wall around both of our bases, so we're, we're protected by a wall together. We've got our own bases, our own loot and everything. Yep. Y'all bring, y'all bring us resources and bring us the stuff to make things for you, we'll make them for you. And we'll give you scrap for resources you give us, and then we'll make stuff for you for free. Because you need scrap to research stuff, obviously. I would so much love nothing more than that. Same, yeah. I'm very happy right now. <laughs> you gotta put a chat, put a chat. Alright. I don't know how I feel about this. You know, yeah. we've been planning the whole time just to raid them. No, because I thought we were going to raid them. Like, you're, like, doing, you're, like, building a whole compound and like that so we could raid them easier. Yeah, like, what? I don't know. Dark, what do you want to do? Do you want to freaking actually team up with them, or do we want to team up with them? I think we should team up with them. With them. Like... No, 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 they're, they're going to raid us. It, it just feels like that. Why would they come up with a plan like that? They're, like, they're, like, grind salt for smart, us. Because we're both, it's Im Im uh, mutually beneficial. It's actually smarter than most shit. If you attack each other, yeah. then we're fucked. But and we if we have betray them, like two days already, just to raid them. Yeah, but we can put those use forces to better use. Should we tell them though that we have a bunch of the stuff so we can just raid them tomorrow morning? I mean, so we can just raid um the guys that you wanted to tomorrow morning. So I would like, love when to fuck these over. But yeah, we should tell them we have shit to take them on as well. 
do what we have and even up the supplies. But yeah, I do think teaming with them would be a good idea. Because then it helps us, because if we need help from other people trying to raid us, we have them to help, and they have good shit. Even though they don't have, like, best aim and shit, it's better than nothing. And but, they'd probably let us use their weapons if we were getting raided and shit. But their but their teammates wants to raid us. Yeah, their teammates do want to raid us. But then again, we want to raid them. Well, yeah. if they do try, we do have set up stuff. And I am ridiculously active on this fucking game. So I'll make sure stuff is set up for defense. We just gotta make sure the defense is set. Alright, if we're if we're actually agreeing to this, if if we get raided by them then it's on me. Yeah. We'll put it that simply. Okay, he's, he's here, he's here. Alright, All right, go on, Mike. After finally deciding to come to an agreement on whether we were going to raid them or trust them, we decided to mix them between both and actually just use them for now, get the gears that we need, get anything that we don't have research, while we get them stuff, they give us scrap so we can research better stuff. And it worked pretty well so far. And we're going a little bit farther into the story here, um, where we're going to raid these one guys at Bandit Camp that were just camping outside Bandit Camp, you know, kind of messing with us. So, yeah. Or, uh, yeah, I guess so. But I don't know what else would be in there. If you think you can get I can, out, I can I'll barely get there and I'll bro. try to guard. Yo, alright, hey, you're going to have to move. I'm going as quick as I can. I'm almost here. You know, I need someone to cover me while I do this. I can barely I'm see two. Here, this is me out here. Can someone can someone shine the light? Like, does anybody else have a yeah, light on the gun? Me. Oh, I don't have a light on the gun. Torch? Anything? Wait, how do you use a light again? Hold triangle. Console. Oh yeah, I do. Shine the light steady. I run, run, run. Fuck. That's all of them, right? Yeah. Nope. One of them didn't explode. Oh, one more. oh he's opening it. It's, it's, it's open, it's open. Yep. Who has ladder? Who has ladder? Who has ladder? I got it. I'm coming down here. Okay. I authorize. Definitely was not worth the raid, if I had to say in my opinion. We wasted a little bit over like 15 or 20 satchels trying to get to the top layer and then just going through the garage door. So it was a bit of trouble for nothing. Boys, what are the cuts? I got the guy. I got, I got the guy. I got, yeah, I got the guy at the top. I got the guy at the top. He mounted. Come on, come on, come on. Now this is actually where the video is going to end, because this is the end of part 1. Yes, there is going to be a part 2 to this video, I will be working on it, it'll probably be out before the end of the month. Hopefully, you know, I still have performance tasks for school and stuff, so once I get those done, uh, you know, video is going to be coming out left, right, and center. So I'm very excited for that, if you guys enjoy this part 1 in any way, shape, or form, please do like, don't forget to subscribe, peace out, bye. Looking for love so true